Generators of hazardous waste may only accumulate waste on site for a limited period of time. Except under special circumstances, generators who generate less than 1,000 kilograms, but more than 100 kilograms per month, called small quantity generators or SQGs, may accumulate wastes on site for no more than 180 days. And they may not accumulate over 6,000 kilograms at any one time during this period. To keep track of accumulation times, the date on which waste is first placed inside must be entered on the label. The on-site accumulation area must be clearly marked to warn passers-by. And the wastes accumulated there must be protected from weather, accidents, sources of ignition, and vehicle traffic. All hazardous waste accumulated on site must allow adequate aisle space for people and equipment to access and inspect the containers or vessels. To afford additional protection against releases, most liquid waste accumulation areas are on leak-tight impervious surfaces and have some form of secondary containment, like a concrete berm under and around the containers, or in-floor trenches that channel and capture leaks. Any wastes that are incompatible or reactive must be separated so that leaks cannot make contact. To make sure that accumulation is being conducted according to established standards, all portable containers holding hazardous waste must be inspected at least weekly. A written record is kept of each inspection, and if an inspection turns up any problems, like damaged, open or incorrectly labeled containers, the problem must be fixed immediately 